Welcome to the NEMAP video tutorial series on the Map Browser. My name is Brendan and I'm part of the product team here based in Sydney. Today, I'm going to show you how to measure confidently without leaving your office. You'll learn the line tool, the area tool and the radius tool. They'll save you a site visit. Welcome to Sydney Olympic Park. Originally designed to host the Olympic Games held in the year 2000, now it finds itself a popular location for sports and recreation. This would be perfect for our demonstration today. Before making a selection, we recommend that you zoom in as close as possible to make more accurate measurements. Let's start with the radius tool. This arena over here will be perfect. Let's zoom in and it's just a matter of placing uh, the first point as close to the center of the object as you can. So clicking and then dragging uh, the, the radius out. Clicking again to close that off. You can see that I didn't do a very good measurement there, but that's okay. To move that, you can just click and hold in the center and move the item, or you can just click and drag that line out to make it a little bit bigger. Releasing the mouse will close that off. So you can see as well, you've got a number of options like the label, you can turn that on and off, and you can also select a unit of measure to suit your need. Most of those objects are the same for each of the measurement tools. Let's display the line tool next. So I, I think these funky little lines will be quite cool to measure. So let's zoom in and you can place your first point by clicking and then you can drag the map out as you need by clicking and holding and dragging the map. And you can click to place the second point. And I might place another, drag the map again and place. And then we'll finish it off over here. Double click to close the line off. And you can see a couple of other options there. You've got the total and the line bearing, which can be individually turned on and off. Same units of measure. Right, let's have a look at the area tool. This park over here might be perfect for that. So the area tool selectable at the top. And let's zoom in. And it's very similar to the line tool in that you click to place your first point. You can still drag the map uh, as you move. And you click again to place your second point. I'm going to place four, so we'll place the third one there and then we'll place the fourth one here. It's just a simple double click to close that off and you've got the same options, the line and area tool that can be disabled or enabled as you wish. For all three of those tools, it's a simple matter to just click this little bin to delete them. I hope this has been helpful. Please don't hesitate to have a look at our documentation if you'd like more information.